this is what I always say. There are three things in fucking, uh, there are three things in, fuck, god damn it, as I'm being stabbed in the face. There are three things in Colorado Springs, churches, pawn shops, and tattoo shops. That's all that's in Colorado Springs. And now it's, you could say it's a weed shops because the weed got legal after I moved out of there, but. Oh, no, no one here is, you have to worry about that, Scott. You know what else, Scott? The uh, the fucking <laughs> wow, good job, Mr. Gargoyle, man. I say crazy, like not crazy liberal shit, but I say liberal shit in this chat all the time. So, yeah. Well, I mean, Scott, I basically live in Littleton. I live in Morrison County. In unincorporated, uh, or Morrison, in unincorporated Jefferson County, and uh, right, right there, dude. My my neighborhood is as fucking blue collar as it gets, Scott. Okay, we need to fall onto this platform this time instead of off. Yeah, I, uh, I, uh, there are so many fucking, dude, my friends live, uh, like, I, like three quarters of a mile away from me, and there is literally, I kid you not, the people that live across the street from them are these fuck, they're amazingly fucking redneck, even though one of them is, is, Mexican, like literally from Mexico, and she thinks Trump is great. And I'm like, what? Yeah, Scott, it's, I, I don't understand, like, I understand why people are here and they stay here, and I don't understand why, like, people wouldn't want to be here. It's like cost of living is the biggest thing, right? I am certain we will not meet again. No, so, linguist, my problem wasn't the magic build. My problem was that I didn't know about the world tendency. The world tendency was my real problem. Yeah, it's, Scott, that's crazy, man. That's fucking crazy. I don't understand it. I'm like, I, I know another one. I know my, my friend, uh, Casey Nightborn, who lives up by you guys. She's a little further north than you, Scott. She lives with a Mexican who moved who moved here from Arizona or from New Mexico. Mexican, his parents are actually I think from Mexico and he loves Trump. And I'm like, Trump hates your Trump hates non-white people. You realize that, right? <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. The only reason I'm like I think I'm still in the area is like because I bought a house before the fucking ship got too bad. I bought a house in 2013, Scott, before the the housing market exploded again. I hate this zone. I hate it real bad, but I know what I'm doing this time, so it's at least like reasonable. Yeah, Scott, that's, I mean, you made the fucking right choice because I'm sure even what I like, I'm not saying anything. So Zeke said he, they're, they're paying. I don't want to like Zeke has admitted how much he pays in rent. Right. So I don't want to say anything out loud, Scott. Like, is that okay to say what Zeke has said? I don't want to, <laughs> because of what you own, I don't want to like, you know, yeah, exactly, Scott, but. He said you, he pays 2000 a month for rent is what, or maybe Katie said it. One of the two said it. I don't know which one of the two said it.
The bank doesn't want your money? Why wouldn't the bank want your money, Cake? Mulder! What's up, buddy? Yeah, I, that's what I was saying, Scott. I was like, you, you're, you're, you're probably making profit on that, and you're still giving Zeke a really good deal. And I'm like... <laughs> I mean, are you surprised by that, Mulder? I mean... So you're saying that's my fault? Do you like fish sticks in your mouth? Then you're a gay fish. <laughs> Jesus, Cake. I... How am I supposed to know when there's going to be a random fucking person in chat that's going to fucking... Oh, fuck. I fell off. God damn it. Urine is sterile, and it, you like the taste? No problem, Mulder. You are you are Claw's dad, and me and Claw are the same person, so... It, like, you're kind of like my dad, too, Mulder. Yeah. Scott, I mean, he keeps saying he's going to buy your house, but, like, is he going to really? I don't know. That's, like, a lot of commitment, right? I mean... So, my mortgage for this house, Scott, is I paid $200,000 for this house in the beginning of 2013. So, like, houses in my area are selling for double that now or something like that. Yeah, that's a really good – Scott, that's a really good friend, man. I mean, that's like – you bust Zeke's balls a lot, but that's a good deal. Yeah. Well, Scott, my fucking foundation shifted last year, and I still think I would make double selling it. Like, that's how crazy it is. Yeah. Yeah, you live in a, you live in like real real the center of Atlanta though, right, Claw? You own a Switch King. <laughs> oh, I love you guys. Well, like the the rent the rents in this fucking area, like Scott could probably charge three thousand dollars a month for that house, renting it out at least pretty easily. I think at least three thousand. There's so much, I mean, it's, like, there's so much, yeah. It just depends on who's willing and how desperate people are, right? I had friends that lived, like, off of MLK in Denver, Claw, that they bought before everything blew up. And then they, when they bought, like, I th or they sold to move, like, Three quarters of a mile away, they're, they're like a hundred and seventy-five thousand dollar house. They sold for close to four. Nice file. <laughs> I mean, Scott, but that's the thing, man. You're that's real estate. That's like what it. Like you're not ripping them off. It's just fucking how it works. Yeah. I mean, you could you could buy a house and it could be like it can go up dramatically or your fucking area can crash and you can yeah. But we all know how uh Zeke feels about gambling, Scott. <laughs> Ow, you butthole. Ow! Get off me. S 
So I don't know how uh, vile the uh, the the uh, Chicago house market has changed over the last. I Scott, I don't know if I told you. I was driving home from work, like in the middle of the day, when he he called his mom to to ask her which recipe she wanted. I was la I almost fucking died from laughing so hard because during that phone call, I'm like, holy fuck! Oh fuck! Out oh, no! That was bad. That was real bad. That was real bad. I'm trying to fucking get this uh this other half of this uh giant monster taken out so I could I don't have to come all this way again. Fucking shit. Well, it's funny, Claw, is like do you even have to like how where is your office that you never have to go to now? Fuck the lock on in this man. Can we make claw burgers? Oh okay, claw. I mean, buying a house is so much. Tr you don't even realize like what kind of fucking goddamn it. So why do you live where you do, Claw? If you've never had an office, like I figured with the where you work, it. Man. Like, I think owning is the only reason I'm still here, Scott, because I, it would have been real hard for me to afford buying, a, like, renting at the prices they're at in the area, but yeah, it's a lot of fucking hassle. Yeah, I mean, Molder, that's kind of shit happens, right? Fuck! God damn it! <laughs> I was so close. I was so fucking close to getting that other... That sucks so bad. I mean, I'm trying, Greg, but Jesus fucking Christ. I wonder if I have enough for a... Level up. I think I do. That should be enough for a level. Or oh, actually, I don't think it is. But I have one other one. <laughs> I mean, Scott, you would, you would, uh, he would buy, be, uh, getting a deal from you anyways, right? Like, anyways, uh, yeah, I don't know. Yep. Yeah, my, my foundation shifted last year and my front door doesn't open anymore. <laughs> 
So I have to go in and out of my house through my garage? I mean... I mean, yeah, Scott, because then you're not making, uh, like, that... You're not getting that, like, profit that you were hoping on, right? Yeah. Okay, I'm 600 short. Damn it. I mean, Dr. Claw is, right? I don't know if I said that out loud, but... Everyone wants cake. What are you talking about, Claw? Yeah. I mean, that makes sense, Scott. It's like... Because I, I don't... I don't know if Zeke and, and uh, Katie fully comprehend what this housing market's like in the state. Like, I don't know if they fully. I'm not saying. You know what I mean? That like it's. I can forge weapons. Because they haven't had to go into it. Jay, what's up, buddy? You come back alive. So like Pokemon cards. Who's selling Pokemon cards? And I saw some motherfuckers going into Walmart on like Twitter the other day, and they were all like killing each other over Pokemon cards. I love them both to death, Scott, even though I don't know, Zeke doesn't really know who I am, but like they're both sweet people for sure. But yeah, that's like the kind of stuff that, I mean, Zeke lived in Montana where nothing is real. <laughs> <laughs> I am fully prepared. Is this motherfucker free yet that I let out of there? Is he up here so he can sell me shit? Where is this butt fuck at? God damn it, I hate him. I mean, Mulder, he has money. That's not the thing. You big city now, bitch. <laughs> what is a Jaffa cake? I don't even know what a Jaffa cake is. <laughs> I mean, I... Uh I've only been in Zeke's community for a year. Like, I'm pretty new in the whole process, right? So. But I'm a KD mod now, so, I mean, maybe. I don't know. Can I pick that up? Nope. Tell me what that is floating on, please. I would really like to know what that is floating on. Oh, I mean, that's true, Greg. Man, all the European style, like, food uh, options are pretty fucking good. Probably floating on a map there. <laughs> Someone divided by zero, uh, Lauren. Oh, there's that rod prick again. I mean, I, I it was, it's funny, because, like, the last time... Like Zeke even said my name in chat. It was when uh, I was asking him why he was he was playing, doing that weird glitch at the end of Resident Evil 4, and I think he thought I was like not having fun. I was just curious on what he was trying to do, and then knives tie me out. <laughs> Spongy biscuit. Okay, but cake, cake. I'm right in the fact that you call a bis a biscuit to you is a cookie to me, right? Because the Brits call biscuits cookies. Or cookies biscuits, I should say. So you're saying when you say biscuit, that's what... Yeah, okay. I'm just making sure... Okay. 
Oh, that's why I was confused now. I'm like... The fucking food options are bonkers. What are you gonna do, Vile? I mean, Vile, being a mod isn't for everyone, man. And some people, like, are naturally really awesome at it. Like, Reese is one of the best fucking mods I've ever had. If not the best mod, and... And look, I mean, look at Sea Lion! Sea Lion's a fucking bomb-ass mod. So it's like, mods can be found wherever, you know? What makes you a good mod? I'm not a good mod. All I do in fucking chat is, uh, turn chats into fucking emote only, but... Where? I mean, you modded mo uh, mans? Yeah, that would be why. I don't know. I was just saying out loud more. <laughs> Answering your question. I actually think Katie's channel is significantly easier to mod most of the time. But I could see it. Katie probably has more people coming in saying awful shit about her than Zeke does. And Zeke doesn't care if people say awful shit about him most of the time, right? What's up, LZT? What are you doing up? It's past your bedtime, LZT. Mods basically do stuff like time people out. They, they just do stuff streamers need during the stream, Mulder. They met. They mess with commands. They they time people out. Yep. Yeah, they keep chat in line. They keep. Reese does a lot of. Reese keeps track of how many times I've died. Is her number one priority here. LZT is a wonderful mod. Fuck all. <laughs> I was like, I don't even, I think I knew LZT for a long time before I realized he was a mod because I never saw him actually mod anything. But this kind of like what I'm going to be modding in Katie's chat. I'm just going to be like, fuck all hanging out and, and if needed something happens and I know how to do it, I'll do it. <laughs> fuck. My favorite uh, modding, though, is when uh, Scott makes the uh, gambling things in Zeke's channel and makes it so, like, it's the easiest vote of all time. <laughs> yeah, Sea Lion, and it's, like, especially in a bigger chat like, like Zeke's chat, right? Oh, fuck. So, Sea Line, you mean get timed out by example? <laughs> oh, I couldn't resist. Do puns? Oh my god. Horny on main! Horny on main! Horny on main! I mean, fuck, I, I woke up to 50 dicks in a row on uh, our Discord this morning because of science and empathy, so. <laughs> so many penises. So many penises. There were so many of them. So many dicks. <laughs> Man, that's a lot of penises. They were all beautiful cake. On the bedside table. I mean, 
I've had my light up, uh, I've had my light up, uh, uh, lightsaber dildo on my light, tight nightstand at times, but granddad Mulder. Yeah, Greg, <laughs> I woke up this morning to the, the nude section and it was literally science had put 50 dicks in a row, like dick pics in the, the, the discord. I'm like, I'm cool with this, but that's a lot of dick. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it just depends on what your opinion on 50 dicks is, Greg. God, I hate the fucking when you don't hit things. There were a lot of dicks in the Discord. He's a busy boy. Like, I've noticed in my time knowing Greg that this happens every couple of months. He gets real, real busy. And then, like, then he's pretty casual for a while again. LZT! Vile, thank you so much for gifting us subs to LZT. LZT, welcome back to the Empire Rod. Oh, hell, get out! I would show you, uh, uh, Dr. Claw, but you don't know how to use Discord because you're apparently 87 and not really 37 because you have four Discord accounts, which you don't know how to use any of them. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, come on. Be adventurous, Claw. Fuck. Does claw one finger type? <laughs> the funniest part about that would be claws a fucking uh, writing editor. If he one finger typed, I would laugh my balls off. Oh my god, claw! I want to see you type because that would make me laugh my balls off. It's so so claw. So, so, so slow, slow. I think at this point I need uh, <laughs> to figure out where the worm guy is so I can actually buy potions in the fucking... He might be in the next level. I don't fucking know. Man, who's the slowest? Like, okay, who's the slow typer here? I really want to know. Villy, Villy doesn't need to type fast. Villy fucking communicates every emotion he needs with raccoons. File, thank you so much for gifting a fucking sub to the linguist. The linguist, you now have access to baby gizmo. Baby gizmo and gizmo sipping and, and rod and all that stuff. Enjoy your emotes. They're wonderful. Welcome to Empire Rod. Oh, hell, gizmo! Thank you so much, Vile. You generous, generous being. Eat a dick. Eat a dick. So if I get this other fucking... Oh, crap. Fucking forgot about this guy again, and he just fucked me up. Want to back up, dude? Fuck! Die! 